Hi, Silverdale friends. It's Miss Anita again, and I just wanted to go over this book a little bit more. We're going to have some questions on it. The, the who, what, where, when, and why questions. So I want to ask you the first question. Who is this book about? If you answer just me and my mom, you are totally right. It's you and your mom. Or for this one, me and my mom. And I see that our friend here has a little frog that he's taking with him. And the next one is, what is this about? You can see by the picture here what it's about. If you answered they're taking a little trip to the city, you are so right. Wow. And where is it taking place? Well, we kind of answered that in the what question, but it's also taking place, I noticed. It starts out where? This looks like the country. You're right. The country. And you can see what they are going on is those are train tracks. So that's how they're going to get to the city by train. And when, when do you think this takes place? Is it nighttime or daytime? You're right, it's daytime. It's definitely taking place in daytime because it's not dark out. And why are they going to the city? You're right if you answered that they went to the Museum of Natural History. You're right if they if you said that they went to the Indian exhibit. You're right if they went if you said they went to the aquarium. And you're right if you said they went to the art museum. They did all of that. They had a fabulous trip in the city. And <clears throat> You're right <clears throat> if you said they went and had a hot dog at a hot dog stand. They, that's why they did all of that. And you're right if, if you said they even went shopping. Does our friend look very happy here with the shopping? Are you guys happy when you get to go shopping? And what was his fun part? His fun part. What do you think was his fun part? You're right if you said going fast in the taxi and getting to ride in the front seat. Looks like they had a full day. So thanks for going over these questions with me and I'll see you next time.